Thank you, Matt. Tucson is celebrating as the old Pueblo's very own Cord Jefferson won an Oscar while directing his first ever feature film, American Fiction. It took home the Oscar for Best Adapted Screenplay. And News for Tucson's Isabella Fredrickson joins us live in the newsroom with what this means to Tucson and for a very talented Tucsonan. Sean, following an exciting win at the Academy Awards, there is no question that this Oscar win is making all of Tucson proud. Cord Jefferson. <laughs> Cord Jefferson, who wrote and directed the Academy Award-winning film American Fiction, was born and raised right here in Tucson. He's a Canyon Del Oro High School grad, and his roots in the old Pueblo runs deep. Film Tucson director Peter tells me that they could not be more proud. Film Tucson's super excited for Cord. Uh, couldn't have gone to a, a, a better writer, better director. We are just really excited to see his career taking off. Really exciting to see where things are going to go for him in the future now. I also spoke to an elementary teacher of Cord's. I had the um, privilege and honor of being um, a gifted advocate and teacher for Cord when he was in fourth and fifth grade. Um, even today, when I see him at age 42, I still see the little boy that was inside that 42-year-old man. Cord's old teacher says that Cord was a character even when he was young and describes his youngster personality and humor as snarky in the best way. And, uh, you see that in his film work today, that his sense of humor still comes through. And I think he's kind of known for that. Clearly, the strong personality his fourth and fifth grade teacher remembers carried on to his successes. To be here now and, and to receive this, this kind of response is, is uh, yeah, it feels incredibly surreal. I'm so grateful for it. I think everybody on the film is so grateful for it. What does this win mean next? Well, the film Tucson director believes that this win will change the movie scene in Tucson. I think it's going to validate a lot, a lot of local filmmakers. I think it's going to give them a lot of hope that uh, they could be in Court Jefferson's shoes someday. So we're right there behind and we're really excited about all of it. Peter confidently tells me that Cord will make his return to the old Pueblo soon, whether it's for an appearance or to make a future film based in Tucson. Reporting from the newsroom, Isabella Fredrickson, News 4, Tucson. Thank you, Isabella. All